first-person shooters have had a long relationship with World War II and killing Nazis. And this is where it all started. Now stop me if you've heard this one before. The Nazis are up to no good and it's up to one stinking American to stop them. Yeah, that is Wolfenstein. Now the PC version of this game is classic Nazi wasting goodness. But on the Super Nintendo, well, Wolfenstein 3D is what I like to call pussified. Being pussified is a growing epidemic in the United States where kids get trophies for coming in last place, lawsuits are for anything and everything, and people can't say the word fat because it might hurt Tubby's feelings. It sucks. Wolfenstein 3D is a microcosm of American society. Now let's get to the game. Standing between you and victory are a whole lot of Nazis. The elite guard, the officers, the zombie mutants, they're all there, but they don't quite sound right. Stop. Oh! Why are Z Germans speaking Z English? Sounds like they're from freaking Iowa. Don't tell me to stop or halt. I want Aktun. And where is the blood? Is that too much for gamers to handle? What is going on? Where are the dogs? I really want to put a bullet in Fluffy's skull. Nintendo mucked this up so freaking badly. Somewhere between PCs and consoles, Castle Wolfenstein had some renovations done. Not only were some of the levels redesigned, but they were toned down and de nazi I guess the world wasn't ready for 16-bit Nazi castles. Pussified, I tell you. There are no skeletons hanging on the wall, no blood on the ground, and there's a serious lack of Nazi on the walls. Instead of swastikas, there are blue crosses. I mean, you might as well not even be fighting Nazis. It's not like Hitler's waiting for you or anything. Oh, that's right. He isn't. I'm sure while looking on the walls, you saw the man in the portraits. And I'm sure you saw that that man didn't have a mustache or a red armband. That's because he isn't Hitler. He's the Stottmeister. That's right. The end of the game, you don't even fight Mecha Hitler. The coolest thing ever. You fight the Country Master. The final boss on Wolfenstein 3D on the SNES is as generic as all the Nazis you killed before him. I mean, Nintendo probably wet themselves at the idea of having a pixelated Hitler on their console. Why was Wolfenstein 3D on the Super Nintendo so pussified? Was it Nintendo's censorship policy at the time? Did John Carmack and id bitch out for the dollars? Probably a little bit of both. Now don't get me wrong, Wolfenstein 3D on the Super Nintendo is still fun to play. It's just there's so many changes, it doesn't even feel like the game on the PC. And if you're gonna have a game with Nazis, go all the way. Don't cut some stuff and replace it with blue crosses and oversized rats. Give me the real freaking thing. I want the granddaddy of first person shooters. I want real Wolfenstein. Yeah! Not Statmeister. Pussified.